All right, I'd say it's the start of another day, but actually I'm about halfway into the day today. And uh, not a whole heck of a lot on my mind. You know, I'm just, I'm getting ready for, uh, to leave. It's kind of interesting because I'm, I'm leaving, but I'm not really sure when I'm coming back. You know, that's kind of, kind of strange, you know, to be leaving when I'm not coming back. And, uh, you know, yesterday I, I did a, a couple videos about, uh, you know, what to cook for, for five Cubans. And I actually held one of the five Cubans over for the evening just so she could tell you how it all went, you know, because, uh, who better to tell you? I mean, I could tell you how it went, but I think it would be better if you actually heard from one of the five Cubans, you know, themselves, you know, how it went. So, Mercedes, and, well, she, she's a little shy, you know, to be on. How, how, did, how did dinner for the five Cubans go yesterday? Excellent. Excellent? Excellent. Thank you for the it, time. It was all good? Everything went good. Your mother and father, they like me? Oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> you know they like you. And Felito and Renee and... And everything was good? Everything was good. They're okay. happy and uh, they said thanks. All right. <laughs> anyway, you know what? I got to give, uh, I got to give credit where credit's due, you know? And uh, Mercedes is a uh, absolutely incredible woman. You know, she is, uh, I, I can't say that I've ever really met a, uh, a woman like Mercedes. You know, they, they say that one of the most important, if not the most important thing in a relationship between two people is respect. And, uh, you know, I think there's a song, Respect, R-E-S-P-E-C-T, you know? And uh, I gotta tell you that I, I, I have all the respect in the world for, for Mercedes and, uh, and the, the type, of, uh, type of person that she is. And the fact that, uh, you know, she came to this country with literally almost nothing I think she I think she told me she had two dollars in her pocket you know and now she is uh, now she's working as a uh, nurse practitioner and uh, just um, really really an, an, an incredible woman so Mercedes is going to uh, Mercedes is going to stay here and then she will join me one week from this Friday she'll join me one week for the, from this Friday and her and I are going to have an absolutely incredible vacation. I am going to, uh, I'm going to force myself to relax a little bit. And uh, I, I don't think they've got Wi-Fi in the national parks. I'm not sure. Hopefully they've got Starbucks. But, uh, you know, I don't think they've got, well, if they have Starbucks, then they have Wi-Fi. But, uh, <laughs> but anyway, the, uh, what else is on my mind today? You know, my dad, my dad coming down, I, I got the ticket for my dad to come back down to uh, to Florida, to to, uh, to Wimpyville, to be, be specific, and uh, you know I got to tell you that um, I was thinking about that this morning, and whereas I'd like to sit here and or stand here rather, where I'd like to stand here and say that uh, and say that I'm you know I'm doing it for me, you know doing it for my benefit, um, you know more so than more so than anything I'm I'm doing it for for him because I know that, that he enjoys it down here. And uh, there's, there is a, um, as many of you know, I'm sure, there's a lot of uh, considerable amount of, of stress that, that goes into being a caregiver, you know? And my dad is, uh, his health is, um, you know, he's got his mental faculties. I'm sure he can still, uh, you know, kick my ass in chess, but, uh, but he's slowing down quite a bit. And, and to put myself back into a, into a caregiver position is, uh, you know, it's a, um, it's a, it's a big, it's a big responsibility. And, um, it is, uh, it's something that, uh, I've given a lot of thought to, but, um, I'll just bring him back. He'll just come down this time. It, there's no going to be, n not going to be any ambiguity, uh, uh, as far as how long he stays. I think he's going to come down He'll come down for December and January. And, and stay for December and uh, December and January, and then and then head back. And uh, and and God willing, uh, it'll be you know two months of just relaxation with uh, you know no no emergency trips to the to the hospital or anything like that. But uh, you know I also thought I, I also thought it might be nice for some of you out there. You know some of you uh, 
subscribers or followers, if you will, it might be nice that we give some thought to doing a uh, an Ernie cruise. You know, take my dad like on a on a nice four day cruise. You know, on a cruise ship, and have some of uh, have some of you come along for the uh, for the trip. Wouldn't that be nice to uh, just do a nice four day four day trip out of uh, say Miami or something like that? You know, and make it make it the Ernie cruise. So. <laughs> We'll see about that. I don't know. I don't know about that. But uh, anyway, with all that being said, I need to get uh, I need to get on with my uh, get on with my day, and uh, have a uh, have a great day, everybody. Take uh, take good care. Okay.